<laughs> okay, let me see if I can do this. Feed a baby, record this video, as well as walk through this palette with you today. So I do have some swatches that are on my arm that is currently hosting up my baby's head. So um, I will get to those swatches in a sec. But I do want to talk about the palette really quickly. Actually, Juvia's Place sent me um, the mini collection. So there are four palettes in that collection. And today's video is just going to be focused on the various mini palette from Juvia's Place. So um, I wanted to go ahead and do some... Uh, product reviews of the shadows as well as some tutorials kind of help give you guys some insight and inspiration as to how you can use these palettes um, and if it's something that you may be interested in purchasing for yourself. As I did mention for disclaimer, Juvia's Place sent me these palettes for me to try out and give my honest opinion and that is exactly what we're going to do today. So for the um, palette itself, I really do love the shades in the Berries palette. Um, like I said, here is the actual palette, and I'm going to open it for you to see the shades. And here are the shades for in this palette. So, very pretty colors. Um, one thing to keep in mind about this palette, it is a pigment palette. So, most people think just eyeshadows, but it's very, very pigmented. These are pressed pigments, so definitely keep that in mind. Um, some of the colors do stain. Um, and I only say that from swatching them, I notice that there it's kind of hard to just rub off of your fingers, so keep that in mind as well. Um, but I really do like the palette overall. And uh, okay, so here is the palette. And I want to do some quick swatches for you. So these colors in the palette do not have names. So uh, just keep that in mind. So they're going to be hard to describe. So you just basically describe them by color. Um, but I'm going to start swatching from the top here and we're going to work our way over on the top row and then work our way down to the bottom. Okay. So, um, for the first one, it's more of like a deeper berry color. I'm trying to get close for you guys to see. Don't mind my fingernails. They're totally busted right now because mama hasn't had her nails done yet. So don't worry. We're working on that. So here's this color. See if you guys can see that shade on my finger. Probably not. Let me scoot closer. So it might be easier for you to see. So that is that shade on my finger. And then I'll just swatch it here on my hand, back of my hand. So it's that shade, if you can see it. Moving on to the next shade is more of a matte pink, I would say. So, it's more of a matte pink. It's kind of hard to see with this camera. But we're going to swatch it here. Swatch it here. So that's the pink in the, in the palette. Hopefully this camera will focus for you guys. All right, moving on to the next shade, which I really like this one. And this is one of the shades that I'm actually wearing. It's just probably because it has a shimmer to it. I really like it. It's like gold and iridescent. It's a pretty color. So there is that shade here. Like you can't tell that it looks gold, but it's not. It's really weird. You can see that. Moving on to this one here. This one's also a pretty shade. Let me move this one down here. This also has like shimmer to it, like iridescent, -y, but it's a pretty shade. I'm trying to move back. Can y'all see that? Not the best, but we're working with what we got. Moving on to the next, which this one to me will stain. Um, like I said, these are like pressed pigments, but it's definitely a color that will probably stain. So be careful with this one. But it's beautiful. It's a beautiful color. And here it is right here. This is the color we just swatched. Okay, moving on to the last color, which is this deep plum color here. We're going to rub on that one a little bit. See that? Let's put that right here. 
we're just going to put that right here so you can see those shades so these are the shades in the palette which i think is a very beautiful palette you can do a lot with this creatively too so here are the other here are the shades on my fingers up close which i hope makes better sense because you can barely see so those are the last three in the on the bottom three that is the swatches for the Juvia's Place, the Mini Berries palette. So, so thanks so much for watching today's video, you guys. I really do hope you enjoyed this product review um, of the new mini palette uh, by Juvia's Place, the Berries palette. Like I said, I'm going to get into uh, reviewing the other three palettes that I received from them as well. I think that they're all great colors. But like I said, keep in mind that these are pigmented or pressed pigments. Um, so they're, I kind of, is consider them not your standard eyeshadows, right? So um, they are pressed pigments, so keep that in mind. But anywho, I hope you have a fantastic day. As always, thanks so much for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe, and we will chat in the next video. Bye.